Skyler, how did you feel yeah, like trying to get so today? Uh, um, you know, I thought it was it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. Uh, definitely something different. But you know, uh, we, we came out of the day with with no injuries. You know, we already lost a, a big player on the team with J Ball. So um, yeah, I, I think that's what Coach Simon's main emphasis of, of today was to get out here, get get a lot of reps, have a lot of fun, get in front of the fans, make some plays, and uh, come out of here healthy. And we did that today. Explain okay. the difference between this year and last year. Um, you know, it's just it's just it's a lot different. It's a lot different. Just two different coaching staff, uh, coaching staffs with you know some different perspectives on things and kind of how they run things. It's, just, it's, it's different. You know, it's no matter where you're at, every every program is going to be different in their own way and going to run run it the way they the, the way that they want to run it. You know, and that's how Coach Lyman came in here from the get go and established himself and how he wanted to run this program. And we we've bought in ever ever since day one and we've had so much fun. It's been so much fun getting to know Coach Lyman and this new coaching staff. You know, each and every day. As I was saying out here on the field, you know, practice don't even feel like practice. Like waking up at 6 a.m. for film, like it don't even feel like work because it's just fun. And the coaches taking the, to uh, the time out of the day to, uh, to get to know us as, as people rather than just a football player it means so much to us. And it just makes us want to go and do that just mu that much more for them. So it means a lot to me. It's, uh, it's, it's been a really good spring. You know, I've, I'm really pleased with, the, with how far I've come from day one to right now is, you know, it's night and day different and uh, you know there's a there's still a, a long ways to go but you know I'm, I'm really gonna dial it in and get focused up this this summer and get ready for fall camp and we're gonna be ready to go in the fall I promise how different is it to come into spring kind of as as the guy or at least yeah I mean, like I said you know I was saying earlier it's just it's just a confidence confidence thing <laughs> feels good to have a you know have a, a feeling that you know my coaches and my, my teammates believe in me and trust me and it just gives me a lot of confidence. It gives me a lot of confidence to go make plays and not second guess myself. I'm never looking over my shoulder. Um, and, you know, it, it's, it's elevated our offense, you know, just from the continuity part of it so much. So I'm really thankful for that. And, you know, it's, it's, it's a blessing. You know, I'm, I'm really fortunate to be in this position with, with Coach Kleiman and the new staff. I'm, I'm loving it and I'm, you know, I'm loving the game. So this, this is what it's all about. How have you seen Ryzen get better? Um, to Hunter? Yeah, I mean, he, he's came a long way. You know, I, I really think with his offense that he ran at Michigan State, it's really similar to the verbiage to what we what we do with our offense in the pro style language. So he uh, he's done a great job, you know, and as far as our whole receiving core in general. You know, it's there's a lot of stuff going on with what we do with, with shift trading and motion and, and just a lot of unbalanced stuff. Like, it, it's a lot of little detailed things that you can mess up that can, you know, make a difference in the play. So. Uh, he's done a great job of, of you know, help leading that, that receiving core along with Dalton Schoen. And you've got Zub that hasn't, you know, he couldn't, unfortunately, couldn't participate in the spring. But we got a lot, a lot of good guys in that, in that, uh, that receiving group, that receiving room that has a lot, a lot of talent. You know, I'm really looking forward to, to, to working with those guys some more this, this summer, really elevating our, our continuity with one another. And, you know, Hunter, Hunter's going to be a big part of our offense in the fall. And what does Wheeler give you? You know, I I love I love Sammy. I, I love that story of him switching to tight end. Um, you know, whenever I heard the news uh, that we switched him, uh, one of our younger quarterbacks came up to me and was like, "Hey, did you you hear about Sammy?" And I was like, "Oh no!" Like I I thought that you know he he left the team or something happened, and he was like, "No, he moved to tight end." And I got to thinking about it, and I was like, "Shoot!" Like. He's a big kid. He has a good frame. He can put on some weight. He's really athletic. Like, I really hope he embraces this because if he does, he can really make a big impact on this on this offense. I mean, you guys saw it today. Look, I mean, that catch he made in the end zone with the one hand to finish it all up. Like, he's been making ever since he's he switched over. He has embraced every opportunity, and he makes plays. He works. And he just has a great attitude, and you know, Sammy's going to be successful. I'm so excited to, to get a guy like that. You know, with a, with how much we throw to the tight end, get the tight end involved in the passing game, like you can create so many mismatches. And with how athletic Sammy is, and he's going to put on some weight this summer, and you know, it's it's going to give us a big advantage. I'm really looking forward to that.